been expecting you. I'm putting so much candy, okay? Because your teeth might fall out. Green mortals, stick around. We'll have lots of fun with you in town. I'm Teresa and welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you are here. Welcome to a huge haul for Halloween. Okay, so we have items from the Dollar Tree, Walmart, Target, Michaels, and we're going to shout out some small businesses. So let's get started. Now, first up, we went to the Dollar Tree. These are so cute. These are yellow stars. Not the kind of yellow that I really like, but however, they're really cute. They have a little notch right here, so you can hang them. Or you can use them as, like, filler for your floral items. I thought those were really, really cute. Okay. Then we found the bells. So cute. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but a lot of the Dollar Tree stores are empty. The shelves are, I mean, they don't have enough product to put on there. And that is because I was watching the news the other day. There are hundreds of ships sitting on the ocean waiting to be unloaded. Each ship has thousands of shipping containers. And it takes about three days for each ship to be unloaded. So if you guys are looking for Christmas items, I would go ahead and get them now. Um, because there's going to be a huge shortage. And they were already announcing that on TV. So... Anyways, so that is why, especially they have a huge shortage of plastic. Okay. So these are really, really cute. So, and again, they have a little notch at the top. So we went ahead and picked one of these up. They go really, really fast. And then I found these little green trees. I love trees. It was like my first obsession and it still is. I just love trees. And then, okay, so I showed you guys this before. I had ordered a bigger one from Home Depot, and it was like 30 bucks. and I actually had to go pick it up. I'm like, why do I have to go pick it up? It's something I had to sign for. Anyways, and it was huge. It's probably like this big, but I returned it. So um, I'm really happy with the miniature version, and these are still available. Okay, and then, oh my gosh, so cute. These are a dollar and these are about like three dollars at the Walmart so I just picked up one I always have to have some candy corn and I thought this was really cute this is glass and they do have some very cute candy containers for Halloween but they're plastic and I mean they are cute and they have like you know pick your poison and um, like a candy dish and they actually have the letters on there but I like to stick with the glass because I think it lasts a lot longer and it doesn't scratch or anything. So I picked this up and this reminds me of one of those old fashioned milk bottles. So I thought that was really, really cute. And then look, okay, so they have different colors. I went ahead and picked up two of these. It is for a tea light holder and I don't know, I just love gray, I'm obsessed with it. So they have orange, blue, green, and then the gray. So I did pick up a couple of those. And then we went ahead and picked up some candy. So these are really cute. Bubblegum eyeballs. You see that? And then I did pick up some more um, like the Brock's candy corn. This is the autumn mix. And I thought that was a really good deal for a dollar. So yeah, so cute. So I don't buy a lot of makeup, but I did find this NYX Liquid Crystal Liner. We have it in the gold. You guys can see that. And then we have it in the silver. So NYX is really such a great brand. And that's why I picked those up. Now, these are so cute. These are women's gloves. These are texting gloves. 
And then I picked up a great, these are not texting gloves, but these are actually for the car. So I always buy like a new pair of gloves for the car because I'm always forgetting them inside. And then I did pick up these, these are glass. So this is blue and then we have clear and then throughout the house, I think I have like orange and brown. So these are throughout the house and I bought like a box because I love these. I'm gonna give them away for gifts. I think they're really cute, put a ribbon on it and a little tea light. And I mean, how high end does this look? So cute. And, oh, I found more. Okay, so I'm gonna give my friend one of these. Look at how cute these are. Little candy canes. So yeah, we picked up two and I'm gonna give one to her. I mean, how cute is that? And for a dollar. And then I'm really not into gnomes, but I think the more that I look at them and the more that I see them on videos, I, I kind of fell in love. So this little guy is so cute. And then we also got a gray one and you can hang them up and we're just kind of have like a little gnome family for Christmas. So, ooh, this is actually a Christmas haul too. Okay. And I think they're all the same. Yeah, so I bought a few. And then yesterday, I found the picks. Look how cute that is. So cute. And then we have this one. Guys, look how cute that is. That would look so cute, like in a floral arrangement or wherever you want to put them. And then, of course, we picked up some more uh, hand wipes. So these are 50 of them in here, and I like the fact that they're in a plastic container, and it is recyclable. Because I did a huge donation, so I did get rid of all of mine, but you know, that's okay. So, we have more. Now, <clears throat> I did buy these last year, however, these are out again, so I always like to show you guys what they have in the store. So this is so cute as a candy dish. And it is plastic, so a little tray. So they have green, they have orange, and this is kind of like a, not a maroon, I don't know, like a dark orange, I guess, a burnt, probably like a burnt orange, I guess. So cute. And, <coughs> excuse me, they do have the pumpkins. So again, I bought these last year, but they're out. So. Um, oh, so I have, I bought two orange, and then we do have the silver. I like it better on the other side, it's a little bit more shiny, so you can see that. Oh, and one little gnome escaped. I only bought one, he's on a, a pair of skis. What I would have liked to have seen, these are wood. But I would have liked to see, you know, kind of like wooden, um, wooden skis, if that makes sense. So, I mean, it's still really cute. He's gray. So cute. Love that. Okay. And then they have, let's see. Oh. So, the other day I went to work and I've been using that crack an egg where it's all made up. It's all of the vegetables are cut up and you just crack an egg. And... I had my egg in a container and it went all over everywhere and it was it was a mess so I bought this as a little container for my egg and I thought it was really cute this is like little um, like silicone at the top so I thought that was really cute because I don't have a small enough container for an egg because it it kind of like um, switched around in my lunch bag and it broke and believe me it was everywhere everywhere really loved the fact that i had to come home after working 12 hours and clean up my old lunchbox i was like what on earth is that so yeah i thought that was really cute and it does snap shut and it's pretty tight and i think these are for like little kids snacks so you know because i'm a child so <laughs> and i went ahead and bought some candles for halloween so the black 
And then we bought like the chartreuse. So I bought three of them. I bought two black and I bought one chartreuse. Okay. And I bought these last year. These are very hard to find. These are little shot glasses, little skeleton shot glasses. They're very hard to find. I have, I think I have like two sets. And I wanted to buy more because I think that's such a, just a cute little gift. And then, as you guys can see in the corner, right over here, can you see that? That is um, one of the skeleton candles. And these I have left over from last year. I did buy a couple more, though. Um, so this is purple. And then we have, that is the orange. Okay. And then they have black. Love, I think that's my favorite. And... Then they have the green. It's kind of like a light chartreuse, if that makes sense. And they have, okay, let me empty this out here. So they have, these are back. So like these are a little, like a witch's spell book. They have a lot of different kinds, but this is from last year. I didn't buy another one and it has a little eye on the top. And again, it's really good for like when you put your items away to put all my candles in there. And so I fit, it fits six candles in here. So, so cute. Now we're just going to do random because you guys have so much stuff here. Okay, so this is actually, I decorated my stairs. So I will link that down below. Um, I did the kitchen. I did the hallway table, I did the stairs, um, and I did the fireplace. And it really helps if you decorate your house in intervals because I cannot do it all in one day. It's a lot. It's a lot of work. So this is from Walmart. I think this is really cute and I have this on the stairs. So I think that's so cute. And <clears throat> you can see right over here in the corner this little tree right here, you guys. So cute. My friend Sue gave it to me. She actually moved to Arizona. And I don't know, I think that's adorable. And I looked on the back, that's from like 1981. And I just think it's really cute. I found some eucalyptus at the store today. So I thought that would be, you know, such a cute, cute arrangement. And they also have, these are back. These are so cute. It is a little spider and it's a tea light holder and it is glass. Now I have a DIY that I've already done. And what you can do is you can pick up some pearls and the wire from the Dollar Tree. And what I do is I make a loop at the end and I twist it. And then you can just make your own strand of pearls. And you can make it any design that you like. I like to curl them because my decorations for Halloween, I, I think they're too cute to be spooky, so if that makes sense. So yeah, I like them to be just a little pretty. So you can make these yourself. And so this one right here cost, I mean with the wire, I've had the wire before anyways. So just buying the pearls, I just bought, you know, probably like three packages, so it was like $3. And you can actually buy these in the store, but they're about, I think they're about $9. So, yeah. so we're going to incorporate these in our design. Now, I love lights. And this is actually from Michaels. So this is a light-up willow tree. And it has 180 purple LED lights. And this was um, like 40% off of 60 And... It's fiber optic and it's huge so I'm really excited I don't know how the Barbie is going to react to this uh, but you'll see it in my Halloween tour look at that look at how pretty that is so I was thinking of putting this in my front entrance so we'll see we'll see how that goes <laughs> huge box okay so I love pillows especially the ones that are shaped so these actually come in a package and I'm going to try to link everything below as long as it's not sold out this is a black cat and it has the fringe on here and yeah the Barbie yeah it's just been going a little crazy <laughs> and then also it comes with 
the pumpkin pillow and it has it's it's well made it's like burlap and this is raised a little bit so and the fact that it comes in a two pack is such such a good deal and let's see let me just check my notes and make sure that I tell you guys that these are the correct places um oh yes the this is from Target the hide and eek boutique okay so I got this oh my god this is fuzzy this is so well made this is just the tag on the back I have to probably do a little bit better of a job but look how cute that is I'm gonna have that forever I think that's adorable so yeah this is from Target and I got it online because they don't have them in the stores now this I actually thought this was going to be a lot smaller because this is um, like a needlepoint and let me make sure I tell you guys this is from Plum and Post and I did order it online it wasn't cheap but it's actually very well made and either you can put it on your couch or you can hang it on your wall or just incorporate it in a display and it is small enough so here's my hand so yeah I really I thought this was gonna be a lot smaller so cute very very well made now from Target <laughs> these are so cute these are string lights these were ten dollars and they're little skulls and I don't know I just think they're really cute these are very well made and there's 20 of them in here and they're LED so these will last for a long long time these are I think they are yes they are battery operated so that's okay I've already went through I'm on my second pack of uh, AA batteries. So, and I do buy the Energizer. I did buy some from the Dollar Tree, and those are okay as well. But if you buy the huge pack from Energizer, they'll last you for years. Just make sure when you do undecorate that you take all your batteries out. So now, <gasps> these are skeleton hands, and they are color changing lights. Are these color changing lights? Does it say that? It does not. Okay. So these are color changing. You guys can see that. And there is how many on here? 20. Now that is a great deal for $10. Barbie, are you having a good time? Can you hear crunching? That's her. <laughs> so again, these were 10 bucks. So I thought that was a great deal. And then these, oh my God, these are my favorite. So this is LED, a wooden cat, and they are just kind of highlighted in gold a little bit. There is 10 on here, but they're pretty big. You guys can see that. And I thought these would be at least 20 bucks. And again, this is LED. All of these are LED. So yeah, so cute. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Now... This is so cute. This is a skeleton cup. I was a little disappointed. It did arrive chipped, as you can see right here um, and right here. So I did order it online. And, you know, I'm not about dissing companies. So I just, I did email them and um, so that's that. <laughs> So anyways, I thought this was really cute. Little skull cup. And I did get this from uh, Target. So this is a little charcuterie tray. And you guys, I was looking for, I don't know. You know how you, you, you want something and like you just like obsess until you get it. I finally found it. This little orange pumpkin spoon. Yeah, I know I'm crazy. I am. Um, but I thought this was really cute. And I, again, I will put all the links below so you guys can get these if you want. So I think that this is so cute because I needed a, like a, a wider one. And the good thing is, is about using, um, you know, buying something like this, I mean, it'll last forever. So I thought that was really, really cute. 
Now, from Grandin Road. His eyeballs. Don't you guys look? I thought these were going to be wooden, but they're very, very light. And, uh, Brandon Road. There you go. And I have a whole box. So cute. So yeah. These took a long time to get. So I'm glad I ordered them a while ago. Now I think I'm going to save this next one for last. So I was at Home Goods and I did pick these up. So these were 20 bucks. And I'm going to return them. Um, these are wine glasses, and I really do love the little ghosts on here. These are actually a DIY that you can do. They have these wine glasses at the Dollar Tree, and then you just have to get an applique like this. Now you can't get you can't get this quality at the Dollar Tree. You'd have to order it online. And these are on here very very well. I mean, it is very well made. This is almost looks like it's Swarovski crystals but um i'm pretty sure i'm going to return these though so yeah those are so cute i was at the home depot the other day and they had some pumpkins like this they were actually led and they were orange and i didn't buy them and then i saw a few hauls on youtube and i'm like why didn't i not buy them so i actually went to two home depots yesterday and i finally found these at Lowe's so what I really like you have to buy these in the store so what I did actually from Home Depot I actually was going to order them online and then I had two that I was going to order and they were different they almost looked like the night before Christmas the old pumpkins that they used to have it was kind of like that and then they sent me an email stating that they had canceled it I, I bet you somebody picked it up in the store and they didn't have it so yeah, so they're out. So anyways, I did pick this up at Lowe's. And what I really do like, okay, let me get this out here. Okay, this is a Christmas bulb. And look, you guys, it plugs in. Oh my gosh, I'm ecstatic for that. So I know a lot of things that, like once the LED goes, I mean, the LED lights are supposed to last for a long, long time. But I really like buying things that if it does burn out or like sometimes they have those little button batteries and if you replace them sometimes they still don't work I love the fact that this will last for like ever okay you just put it in here and yeah that's it so I found this one I found this guy right here and again it's the same look how cute that is it's just so classic I really do like that Barbie's just sitting there looking at me. <laughs> and this is almost the one that I was going to get, but the LED one, it actually was covered here, and uh, it was just really, really cute. This one here, I actually have to put batteries in here. So I have a question. Why on earth do I have to unscrew this at the bottom here? I mean, it's so annoying. But again, when this is like a little, almost like echoing, um, when this does burn out, this is like a little button battery. I mean, it almost looks like a button battery kind of light, but it's not. But once that does burn out, I can just go ahead and like, you know, push my hand in here and, you know, put something else in there. Or you can actually take this off from the bottom because there are, it is screwed in. So you could always take it off and just put like a, a battery op operated light in there. So I thought this was really weird really really cute so yeah not a lot of Halloween decorations out I'm just I should have started shopping like weeks ago so yeah I thought that was really cute now <laughs> okay I have to get up to get this this one I did this one I actually got at Lowe's as well <gasps> look at this Okay, so I did put batteries on this. Look at that. And it's LED and it's supposed to last forever. Guys, love that. 
So I decided like each year I just want to get like one huge pumpkin. So look at that. And they had one. So, yeah. I don't know. I think he is too cute to be spooky. I don't know. Sometimes, you know, if you've seen something, it's so ugly, it's cute. And that's the case for this guy right here. <laughs> okay, Miss Barbie. All right. So I'm going to shout out some small businesses. So this is confectionery soaps. Okay. Now it's an online shop and they have, she hand makes everything. Sugar scrubs, um, lotions, oils, and the fizzy soaps. Barbie, you're very, very distracting. Okay. So. So she has her little brochures and everything. Okay. And she lives in Maryland. And I will link her down below. Every she only has launches every few weeks. And as you can see, here's some of the pictures. Ow, will you stop it? Okay. And uh, I mean they're so I don't even know how they make something like this. Oh, Ooh, this is pineapple. I'm gonna open this. Smell this. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Mm. Barbie. Ow! Ow, she's like clawing me. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. So good. So our bathtub's gonna be all nice and glittery. Okay. Oh, this is another one. Pumpkin crunch berries. Jelly soap. Oh my gosh. Another sample. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good. And it is like jelly. Can you see that? Everybody goes absolutely crazy. I know she had a launch and things sell out literally after an hour, almost everything was gone. Barbie, you're going to get a timeout. <laughs> so she keeps calling me out. Okay, so, oh my gosh, this smells so good. Okay, you want the ribbon? Here, you can have it. There you go. Okay. So good. Oh my gosh. <gasps> wow. Look at this. This is Miguel. This is a bath fizzy. I mean, how do you even make something like this? That's she's she's very talented. Look at that. And you don't even have to use this whole thing. And um, I actually wanted to get oh my gosh. You guys, it smells so good. Look at that. Just look at that. Look at that craftsmanship. That smells so good. So yeah, you don't even have to use the whole bar. You use like pieces. And she actually has like a cutting knife, which she was sold out of, that I want to order as well to cut these. Because there's a special knife to cut these with. Oh my gosh. Oh, another sample. Barbie, I swear you have the ribbon, honey. There you go. Okay, we're gonna push you. We're gonna push you away a little bit. <laughs> you guys have no idea what's going on around here. Okay. <laughs> okay, so this is tea and cakes mm, signature collection. Okay. So I can't open this, but this is glittery, and I'm sure it smells so good. <gasps> Let's see. Oh, 
So yeah, we got the um, the Miguel Bath Fizzy and the Binks Jelly Soap, which is coming up. Gosh, look at this. And it's Disney inspired, and I think that's why people are just so crazy about it. I don't know if I should open. I'm probably not going to open this because I'm going to get it all over, but, oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay. So now this is the Candy Cane Christmas. This is whipped, a whipped sugar scrub. Okay, so we're going to open this. Oh, my gosh, you guys. This is really high end. First of all, look at the label. Very well designed. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I can just tell. I can tell that you're only going to need like a tiny bit because this is so concentrated. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. I am. I'm thrilled with my purchase. So thank you to Confessionary Soaps. Okay, you guys. Oh my gosh. So her new launch is coming out sometime in October. Um, so yeah, look for that. I mean, everything sells out so quickly. Okay. Are you done? Can I show them the last item? I did get this from Walmart and it comes with socks <laughs> and I really do like this it's so cute I think I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this and um, with Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas what I love is you can wear it now until Christmas and if you want to wear it after that's okay so yeah this is really cute this is like a sleep shirt and of course I'm gonna wear it outside and the socks, I'm just really surprised, you guys, because I have, like, athletic calves, and these can actually, look at this, they can actually go over the knee. Oh, these would be really cute with boots. See? Because some of the knee-high socks that I get, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to be honest with you, <laughs> they don't even go all over my calves, so these are very well made. Honey, can we show them the last item? Can we? Oh, this is the Barbie. Hi. Okay, here. Here you go. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Are you just having a ball, aren't you? Okay, here. Come on. There you go. Go get it. Thank you. <laughs> now, this is the last item. Okay. So, this is actually from Etsy. And... Let me just make sure I shout out the correct person. This is Kay's Crayons, okay? And they have a lot of Ray Dunn items, and this is actually a classic. Now, first of all, I want to show you guys. Look how well packaged this is. Look at this. Look. Look at that. That's so nice. That's going to look so good. Yeah, look at that. That's going to look so good for my Halloween. Oh my gosh, it's so nice. Okay. These are so well made. You guys, these are handmade. I mean, you know, so, just so talented. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this is like, 
this is like like faux leather and it's stuffed and even this is material it's not styrofoam oh that's so nice we're definitely going to be ordering from them again for sure so actually i'm going to link them below i'm going to link everybody below okay so now look at this so i've not seen this yet so i'm going to go ahead and open it love this these are so hard to find they're so highly collectible this is the best item that I have ever seen wrapped like this I mean that is amazing I wish all my packages came like this so look at this so cute and as I told you guys I just got into Ray Dunn a few months ago and look at this oh my gosh oh my gosh so cute I'm so happy with this purchase yes definitely so that's it for this video if you guys did enjoy this video please give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and uh, yeah i really do hope you enjoyed this video and i will be putting out my video decorating the fireplace we're going to do a house tour and i'm actually going to do a halloween fort so thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I don't know if anybody has told you today, but you are amazing. And until next time, my beauties, I will see you really, really soon. Mwah. XO.